Hi guys, it's Robert. Today I have a quick and simple bath and body DIY project for you. I wanna show you an amazing way to moisturize your skin by creating your own shower oils. And if you like this project and you wanna see more, I invite you to check out my bath and body DIY playlist and subscribe to my own channel by following the link in the video description below. Now when we shower with soap, we obviously wash away dirt and grime, but we also inadvertently strip our skin of some naturally occurring oils. One way to add that moisture back in is by using shower oils. Today I want to show you how to create two versions, one for the morning to help wake you up, and another version for the evening to help calm and relax you. The first thing we're going to do is select and prepare our bottles. I found these great bottles with a pump top dispenser. I love them because they're plastic, I know I'm going to be using these in the shower, and if I drop it I know it won't shatter. The pump dispenser is also great because it dispenses an equal amount of the oil every time. Now because we're creating two versions of the oils, I want to be able to distinguish between the two bottles in the shower. To do this, I'm going to label them using some vinyl press-on letters from the office supply store. Most plastic bottles have a side seam that allow you to line up the letters. For the morning version, I'm going to be labeling it AM. And then for the evening version, I'm going to be labeling it PM. Once our bottles are prepared, we're ready to mix our oils, and the basic recipe is so simple. We're going to be adding equal parts of three plant-based oils. The first oil we're going to be using is coconut oil. Now, coconut oil that's sold in the grocery store usually comes in a solid format and is sold in a jar. The coconut oil we're going to be using is called fractionated coconut oil. It's processed in such a way that it maintains its liquid consistency. To that, we're going to be adding in avocado oil. And then finally, we want to add in some sweet almond oil. Mix these three ingredients together, and then we're going to add some essential oils. For the morning version of our shower oils, we want to add in some essential oils that will wake us up. To begin with, we're going to add in some spearmint essential oil. And to that, we're going to add in some grapefruit essential oil. The combination of these two create a scent that is bright and will wake you up and get you on your way. Once all of your ingredients are combined, you're going to pour them into your pump dispenser using a small funnel. Then screw the top on and it's ready to use. Now for the second version of our oils, the basic recipe is identical. You're going to begin by adding in your coconut oil, followed by your avocado oil, and then finally add in the sweet almond oil. Now for this second version, we want to add in some essential oils that will calm and relax us at the end of the day. There are lots of options here and lavender is often a popular choice, but I'm going to be adding in some bergamot essential oil. I love this scent, it's a little citrusy and woodsy and definitely has a calming effect. Once all of your ingredients are combined, add them into your pump top dispenser using a small funnel. Then screw on the top and it's ready to use. Now to use your essential oils, shower as you normally would with soap or shower gel. When you're finished, dispense a small amount into your palm, rub your hands together and then rub it into your skin. You'll be surprised at how far that small amount goes. Then go ahead and rinse and towel dry as usual. One concern when using shower oils is that you'll create a surface that's slick and slippery. There are a couple of things that you can do to prevent this. One is using a rubber shower mat to add a little bit of extra traction. But I also want to show you how you can create a daily shower spray to keep your shower clean and safe. To do this, we're going to combine all of our ingredients in one bowl and then pour it into a spray bottle. We're going to begin with one cup of distilled water. And to that, we're going to add a half cup of white distilled vinegar. Then we're going to add in one tablespoon of a dish detergent. This is going to act as a degreaser and break up the oil on the surface of the tile. And then we're going to add in about five drops of tea tree essential oil. Tea tree essential oil smells amazing and it's also an antifungal, making it a great addition to a shower spray. When you're finished showering, spray this onto your tile and then rinse it down. I do hope you'll give this project a try, experimenting with different essential oils to wake you up in the morning or help relax you in the evening. Thank you so much for watching and please join me next time for another great DIY project.